Hello and welcome to my channel. I am Nancy and I am a guest. Please, if you are new here, kindly subscribe to my channel. And if you have been watching my videos and you not just subscribe, please kindly subscribe for us to go to the mathematics community. In this lesson, I am going to solve West African Secondary School uh, Certificate uh, Exams WASI 2022 Federal Mathematics Question 3 or Elective Mathematics Question 3 for WASI 2022. Join me as we go through the solution step by step. Now let's look at the questions. Given that 2 times tangent of 15 degrees divided by 1 plus tangent squared of 15 is equal to sine 30 degrees, you have to find tangent of 15 degrees, leaving uh, our answer in set form or in radicals. So how do we do this? You are not going to use calculator. So this is very very simple. Now, let's solve this. We know that sine 30 is a special angle if we use the um, the two unit equilateral triangle. We have here to be two two thirty we try one. Here is 60. So if we take sine 30, sine 30 is equal to opposite over hypotenuse, that is 1 out of 2. So sine 30 is 1 out of 2. Now, we have 2 times tangent of 15 degrees divided by 1 plus tangent squared of 15 degrees is equal to 1 out of 2. Wow. Now, if we multiply 2 by 2, you get 4 tangent of 15 degrees divided by 1 plus tangent squared of 15 degrees is equal to 1. Wow. Then you do cross multiplication. So this will go here and one will go here, but this is over one. So we have four times tangent of 15 degrees is equal to one plus tangent squared of 15 degrees. So what do we do? Let's group all the terms on one side. We have tangent squared of 15 degrees minus four times tangent of 15 degrees plus 1 is equal to 0. I've brought 4 times tangent of 15 degrees to the right hand side. That is why I've negated it. And I've kept this on the left hand side. So it's the same thing as bringing the 0 here. That's it. But I've chosen to bring it here. Okay, now let's move on. Now, if we let y equal to tangent of 15 degrees. Then here you have y squared minus 4y plus 1 is equal to 0. And this is a quadratic equation. Wow. Mathematics relies on logic and creativity. So this is a simple logic and it is highly creative. Now let's do mathematics for fun. I love you. Keep watching. Kindly subscribe, like, share and leave your comments. Now, how do we do this? You can solve this using the method of completing the square, or you can solve it using the almighty formula or the quadratic formula. So let's use the quadratic formula. Now, we have y equal to negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all divided by 2a. Yeah, this is a equation in y, not equation in x. So don't go and write x here. This it is equation in y. Okay. So now by writing a y squared plus b y plus c equal to zero is the same thing as writing a x squared plus b x plus c equal to zero. So here a is the coefficient here that is one. B is the coefficient here, that is negative 4, and C is the constant here, that is positive 1. 
So I have y equal to negative times negative 4 plus or minus the square root of negative 4 squared minus 4 times 1 times 1 all divided by 2 times 1. So you have y equal to positive 4 plus or minus the square root of 16 minus 4 all divided by 2. y equal to 4 plus or minus square root of 12 divided by 2. You have y equal to 4 plus or minus 2 root 3 all divided by 2. You have y equal to 4 on 2 plus or minus 2 root 3 on 2. You have y equal to 2 plus or minus root 3. Remember that root 12 is the same as root 4 times 3, and that will give us root 4 times root 3, and root 4 is 2, so we have 2 times root 3, that's why we have this one. That is very simple as that from Z. Now, we have y equal to 2 plus or minus root 3. That is, we take y equal to 2 plus root 3 and y is equal to 2 minus root 3. But we said that y equal to tangent of 15 degrees. Wow. So here this implies that tangent of 15 degrees is equal to 2 plus root 3. And then tangent of 15 degrees is equal to 2 minus root 3. Now you can use your computer to check that this one is true and this one is false. So here you've shown that tangent of 15 degrees is equal to 2 minus square root of 3. And this is in set form or in radical form. That is very good. That is a very nice uh, deduction. You can check with your calculator. Point tangent of 15 and it will give you this. Thank you for watching. Please kindly like, share, subscribe and leave your comments. Bye-bye.